on their team. It could also be a great weekend to do some repelling. Chief Meteorologist Aaron Christensen is live on East Broadway with some daredevil Girl Scouts doing just that. What are you doing, Aaron? Are you ready yourself? <laughs> Uh, no, Stella, I am actually going to be staying on the rooftop here, but in order to be allowed on top of the scaffolding, which is on top of 5151 East Broadway, they wanted me to get entirely geared up just for safety purposes. So that is what we're doing up here. And we do have a couple of folks up here. This is Dale. He is going to be repelling down the side of this building, 17 stories in a couple of minutes, just to kind of show you what our Girl Scouts of Southern Arizona will be taking on tomorrow at the Go Over the Edge event. Now we do have a camera that's on the ground as well. We kind of want to give you that perspective of just the the magnitude of what these Girl Scouts and their supporters are going to be doing. So you can see the 17 stories. They are going to be repelling down the side of the building, 76 in all. You can certainly come on out here, cheer on your Girl Scouts and supporters, and even sign up to do the event for next year. The event is tomorrow. It runs from 9 o'clock to 5 o'clock. If you're going to be out here, think water, think sunscreen, okay? It's going to be the warmest day of the year so far with an afternoon temperature right around 93 degrees, but the wind is going to stay light. That's really good news for all of our edgers here at 5151 East Broadway. Coming up, though, we're going to talk about the record heat that's on the way this weekend. Aaron, thank you. A stunning reversal in a case that went national just last week. Five Flowing Wells High School students arrested for a conspiracy to commit murder.